Alright guys, so this is how it starts. I got both motors tore out. Fenders are both stripped down. Sorry if it's weird I'm using a different camera, but today I'm gonna start taking all the pieces off the black one and putting them over on the new frame. Alright, so I'm gonna get started on that and I will pop you back on in a minute. <clears throat> Alright guys, so uh, I forgot to pick up the camera, but I got all the good parts taken off this one and swapped over here. So I have turn signals, horn, LED headlight, new ignition, handlebars, good twist throttle, blinker, headlight brake switch, um, tail light, grab bar, old FMF, new clutch cable that I put on the other one. And that one's ready to go. I'm gonna go post it on those Facebook sell pages and on Craigslist. If you need any parts for it, just let me know. I'll give you a price on it and what it'd be with shipping. So, all right, I'll give you guys an update when I start working on that guy. All right, all right guys, so I'm gonna pop this motor, the head off this motor. So I can check the clearance on the cylinder to see if I need to just rebuild it or if I need to bore it over. This is the motor from that quad. It had just had low compression, so it may just need like a 40 over or 20 over. All right, I'll get back to you when I pull the head off. That came off fairly easy. I did have the whole stud come out on the one closest to the exhaust, but whatever. You're seeing this just how I'm seeing it for the first time. Right, there's a little wear on the piston on the top, the intake side. What's that about? So that's the intake side. There's nothing there, there's a little scarring on it right there, if you can focus, but... A little burning... What's that? Just carbon? Yeah, that's just carbon build up. I don't know why there's two little marks right there, but... All right, I'm going to get my calipers out and measure this. Did the measurements and it came out to about, focus, 2.6 inches. So using the internet, that says it's about 66 millimeters. Which means it's on a stock size bore, but I need a rebuild. Let me grab my flashlight. It's pretty, pretty carbony down in there. It's, it's not terrible, but it is pretty dirty. All right, so I'm gonna go online and order probably a 20 over kit for this one. Hone it out, it doesn't look like it's ever been sleeved or anything, which is amazing to me. Since this is a 89 motor. All right, as soon as I get that kit here guys I will pop this back on and I'll do a video of installing it I might pull the reed cage off just to take a look at the reeds if I do that I'll pop you back on all right reed cage coming off let me grab a little hammer to tap it off okay Got a tat off. <laughs> Gonna need a new gasket. I hear it ripping. That's okay. Ooh, I'm gonna order some reeds for it. I don't know if, if I can get it. Alright, there's a little gap. So 
So they're not sealing all the way. This side looks fine-ish. This side there's definitely a gap. So, looks like I'm gonna order some reeds. See if I can get the piston screw. Let's see if I can, let me wipe my hand off. Left-handed filming. All right, so I can get this cranked over. It's dirty in there. Let's look at the piston skirt. Piston skirt looks good. All right, so I think just need some reeds. Of course, a reed gasket <laughs> and a 20 over ring set. I am going to build the other motor. I decided to not. Um, right now, I'm not going to build it with a crank and all of that. Probably just going to put a 240 kit on it for right now. That one, I'll do a build on that one. I'm going to have to tear that case down. Those little metal, metal chunks falling in it when I pulled the head off. I'm stupid. But I'm going to go. Go online and order a 20 over kit for it. If a 40 over is not that much more, I'll just get that. But I'm gonna order a 20 over kit and probably some carbon fiber reeds or some Boyson uh, fiberglass reeds because I've had good luck with those too. All right, guys, thanks, and let me know if you have any questions. Still parting that one out if you need some parts for it. Everything's there besides motor and back tires. And throttle. No throttle. It was trash. Alright. See you later.